foremost club sides last season, winners of the Champions League and Europa League respectively. Now they lock horns with the Super Cup at stake. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And we are ready to go just about. Millions of viewers from all around the world are tuning in for the Super Cup decider. My name is Derek Ray here in the commentary position. I'm joined by Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're inching ever closer to kickoff time. It's Arsenal up against Aston Villa. Well, I have to say, Derek, I'm really looking forward to this. Both these sides did so well to win their respective cups. I think this should be close tonight. This is the Arsenal starting 11. Bernd Leno begins in goal. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And the starting striker today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. In the battle for the UEFA Super Cup, they're underway now. The goalkeeper has no interest in... El Ghazi. It might be. And a goal! The quick one too. And they've turned this game on its head. Well, the alarm bells are ringing a bit. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. The high press was very much on. It should be. And a goal to seal the hat-trick. A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Oh, he's through here. This is attacking football at its finest. Now well, the pressure being exerted. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, he needs to be careful here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Emiliano Buendia. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. He can't hold on to it. El 
Fugazi. In the battle for the UEFA Super Cup, they're underway now. Not a pass that lacks quality. And great work to confuse the defender. Is it going to be Danny Ings? Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And the chance for Ings. Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well, as you can see, that's a wonderful finish. He just sees the keeper off his line and lifts it over him. That was a great bit of skill. One nil then. El Ghazi, it might be, and a goal! The quick one too, and they've turned this game on its head. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So 2-0 now. Well, the alarm bells are ringing a bit. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. There it is, and he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here we can see it again, and it doesn't get any better, does it? That's just sloppy from the goalkeeper. That's a terrible goal to give away. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Ben White and Dicing with a bit of danger here the high press was very much on it should be and a goal to seal the hat-trick a master class in finishing just can't stop him today Well, here's the replay. And when you've got the ball at the back, you've got to pass it forward. And he doesn't do that there. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Nicolas Pepe, well, beating his opponent. Thomas, really good interception. Anwar El Ghazi. Can he put it away? Chance, maybe. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Oh, he's through here. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, let's.
see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Well, the pressure being exerted. Opportunity here. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay. And when you've got the ball at the back, you've got to pass it forward. And he doesn't do that there. He has his pocket picked and he's been rightly punished. Well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they could add. how to rob them of possession and that is how to beat your opponent can he do it a goal that's two for him today they simply can't stop him no wonder he's celebrating well here it is again it was a good finish but the keeper has to do better at his near post he was beaten far too easily on that occasion Ben White. Well, he needs to be careful here. Is it going to be Danny Ings? Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Ings. Emiliano Buendia. Great opportunity. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. He's driven in the corner. Well, pressure building, another corner. Yep. Corner kick played in. Well, the attack carries an initial threat, but fizzled out. And lining it up. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. He can't hold on to it. El Ghazi. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. And so it is, the first half story has been written.